We need to do a better job of working for working people and working families. We need to get it right and do better for the people who don't have a voice loud enough to register in these hollowed halls of the chambers. We need to make the 11 and a half million people of the state of Ohio our priority again, here in the People's House. Thank you for joining us here in the People's House. As I share some of the details included in and surrounding Aisha's law. So I'm Janine Boyd, state rep for House District 9, which is the district where uh, Aisha and her family resided. Aisha's law, in short, is a continuum to unite law enforcement, the courts, and community in partnership to change lives and, I believe, save lives. And what you will find is that um, Ohio is having an infant mortality and, uh, and a maternal um, mortality crisis, specifically as we look at our Black babies and our Black mothers. Right. Um, unfortunately, we have statistics that are in comparison to third world countries, but we have world class care here in Ohio. So infant mortality is something that we should all be concerned about because we want all of our old babies to live vibrant lives. And why this is important, how this connects to fighting for families is ensuring that we have not just health policies, and investment in health policies. But one of the things that we've been finding is that we really get into the roots of stress and a racial and implicit bias that causes undue stress that goes from the, um, from the mother to the fetus. And then when the child is actually born, how it's cutting people's lives short. 